now you cross that weird line where it's like you're, you know you're, like you're happy a pressure to perform yeah i mean you know the pressure it's not really like i like to explain things they're a little bit more complicated i uh, always use the example of like a tree like the, we'll just call the like the trunk and the tree pressure but then there's a lot of branches that branch out you know it's not just like to perform i mean perform is a part of it right and i mean content creation too i think a, a a big thing for a lot of us you know we're so everybody really hones in on the stats and the numbers are of of things you know because it's funny man that's that's all it is when you boil it down man you know it's pretty crazy you start looking at all these numbers and before you before you know it man it's all you fucking see is numbers it's like holy shit you know how many likes did my tweet get how many retweets did my tweet get how many views did my youtube video get uh how many subs am i on youtube how many subs am i on twitch are the are the viewers good are the viewers not good like it's just before you know it bro it's just numbers 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 you know and then the more the, when you blow up the more numbers you get the more money you get and then you see your bank counting the money's just growing and growing and growing and then you're buying shit and you're doing this you're investing it's just all numbers and you're like holy fuck so you know you hear you hear a lot of these guys talk about not getting too caught up in the numbers but to be honest with you man i mean the numbers i think for the most part is all anybody's ever fucking looking at you know it's tough to say don't get caught up in the numbers when they're so goddamn important you know what i mean but I do agree. It's good advice. It's good advice. You don't want to get too caught up in the numbers, but fuck, man, it's so goddamn important. Competition is probably something that I think is a pretty good amount of pressure, and I think that that go that's across the board at, at any level of content creation. You know, competition is good, and people don't want to admit it. You know, but I think I think the majority of us are always competitive with everybody else. You know, you want to you want to be the best. You want to have more viewers than the next guy. It's just, it was, it's like anything else, man. You know, even when we were kids, you want to be the first kid done. You want to be the first kid that, you know, that comes through the finish line or whatever. The, you know, it's just the way it is, it's life. And I think that a percentage of that is healthy, but then sometimes I think people might get too competitive, you know, and then it's like, now you cross that weird line where it's like, you know, you're like, you're happy, but you're low key not. And then uh, it gets a little weird. And I've been there sometimes too, you know, the, the, the jealousy and whatnot, you know, but after you get past that, it gets, it gets a lot easier, you know, and, and you know, a lot of times, man, you, you're not going to, you just can't, you can't really feel it until you go through it. You know what I mean? I, I have all kinds of examples of that, man. You just, you just don't know until you go through something and then you're like, what the fuck, you know, always prioritize your mental health though, bro. For sure. There's a, there's a lot of you know off stream work that goes into that man trust so I, I, isn't it crazy when when, when when you see or you hear uh about some dude killing himself or some shit you know and the guy's like he'll be like an actor or a songwriter or something or whatever the fuck right and he, like from your pov he's got everything man he's you know, a family you know, millionaire fucking famous and shit right got all this stuff and he kills himself it's just like, what the fuck? Right? Bro, there's some real pressure being in that limelight, man, you know? And by the way, this is no, I'm not, this has nothing to do with me. I'm just, I'm just saying there, there's uh being in the limelight. It's not, it's not always for everybody. So sometimes you might get here and it's like, holy shit, you got to learn how to, you got to learn how to be here. That's another thing too, you know? It kind of, it kind of took me a while for a little bit. I was like, holy shit, you know, I, I, I'm actually cool with it. I, I don't really, this doesn't really bother me as much, I don't think. Maybe it might for some. I enjoy the popularity <laughs> for, for, for the most part. I don't want that to sound weird or anything, but I do, man. I, I have fun with it. It's not for everybody, man. You know? I also think that pressure is really good for you. But it's a tricky bitch, man. Pressure is really, really tricky. It's like it's really good for you, but it can also be really bad for you. And everybody's different. Like, like sometimes, like you take 10 people, you line them up. And you give them the same pressure of something. Everybody's going to deal with it in their own way. And that's the craziest thing, too. Because some things, like, that, that wouldn't even affect you or me or whatever, you know? It would be the end of the world for somebody, bro. And same thing for us. 
Some shit that, like, wouldn't even affect somebody else would be the end of the world for you and me. Perspective, bro. Crazy. If you want to be a content creator, if you want to be a streamer, you, you, you got to... You have to be okay with being there. You know, if you want... That's if you make it, right? Guys, it's pretty crazy now, bro. It's getting... It's getting... It's getting wild, no? Streaming's getting fucking wild. Never thought it'd be like this. But, shit. You can't say or do certain things. Have to be careful how you voice opinions. Someone's always trying to catch you. Yeah. You don't want to be fake. But at the same time, you're right. You, you really can't say anything. But to be honest, that's kind of like life. I mean, just because you can sit at home and bullshit with your friend or family about things that aren't okay to bullshit about, it doesn't mean it's right. Eventually, you're going to open your mouth and wrong the wrong person and get in trouble for it. But I feel you. That is true. You can't, you can't say fucking anything. Nice. Get a match. Yo, so, uh, 300 match, 300 match, bro. Oh my god! Whoa! 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 Wait! Hmm. Wait, what just happened? Did you go backwards? No, I just started flying, bro! Are you cheating? Yeah. 40 on the... On Benji's 100! Cracked! One is cracked, Benji's skin is cracked. You're alone, you're alone. I'm popping big. One dead! Nice, I'm coming. Two dead, two dead, two dead. Nah, let's go, you're so good. Giving yeah. them exactly what they asked for on their Wait, somebody, is somebody! Right. Oh, oh my god, oh my god! god. Hey, Dude, I'm sniping! <laughs> <laughs> let's go! Let's go! Let's go! One, no, no, no. Cringe. One, 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 It's okay, we go again. That was kind of a derpy run, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, born in Jam at the show. Como se la tiene que sacar el ser, eh, pegando en el nipazo. ¿Te ha puesto lo mismo? No. ¡Oh! ¡Oh! ¡Dios!